How's it going guys? 3% Ninja here and welcome to a new game on my channel. This is Resident Evil 2. Came out back in 1998 originally and uh, they remade it in 2019. Good old Capcom bringing it back. Oh there's a... Okay so I unlocked a lot of things. Cool. It's been a while since I played this game. I played 3 but 3 was... It's fun. It's kind of a disappointment <laughs> from the um, from the original story, but it, I guess it's okay for what it is. I'm gonna go ahead and start a new game, and we're gonna be playing as Claire Redfield first. We'll play as Leon Kennedy another time, I think. Mm. Yeah, we'll start with Claire. And we'll, we'll play it on standard. I'm not that great at this game. But, you know, it's Resident Evil. I love it anyway. <laughs> that burger looks so... It looks good, but it looks gross at the same time. It looks juicy. That's a juicy, soggy bread looking burger. Sounds like my wife. Sounds like my wife. I've never seen anything like it. I haven't been able to sleep since that night. All right, calm down, buddy. Calm down. Just, hey, you got to stay strong, okay? Don't give in to fear out there, right? Oh, man, the graphics are so good. If you freeze up around these things, it'll sink to the teeth of them. Oh, come on. It's just getting good. If you imagine if his radio didn't mess up, he would have stopped before hitting that zombie. And he would have been good. I need some sleep. Oh shit! Imagine driving in the middle of nowhere and just a lady is just in the middle of the road. For one, I think she would have been dead again. She just got hit by a truck. But I can shoot a zombie in the head and they stay down. What would you do in that situation? Would you just leave? And that was the lady that was laying on the table, right? You'll see her later on. Yeah, I'm almost there. But if you look back, her leg was completely broken okay, when she was laying on the floor. So I don't know how she stood up. That's good. I'll be back as soon as I find Chris. I will, but I gotta go. Why does everyone think I'm gonna get in trouble? Yeah. People don't wear, like, they don't use umbrellas. <laughs> They're just like, whatever. If I get wet, I get wet. That's how I am, too. Hello? I don't even think I own an umbrella. I, I gotta remember how to play this game. There should be, like, some interaction with the, the cop car. I think Leon is already here. Oh no, Leon didn't drive in the cop car, never mind. Hello? Anybody here? Hello? Hello? There's a whole uh, game mode that you just kind of fight inside this one area. Are you okay? What's up, my dude? Are you all right? You're bleeding from the neck, but are you okay? <laughs> Wait here. I'll check it out. Use your words, man. 
<laughs> He's so rude. Like, honestly, if somebody's bleeding from their neck, would you ask if they're okay? <laughs> oh yeah, he, he locks the door on us. He's bleeding from the neck, he's sitting down, but he's he managed to, what, get up and lock the door on us? Hey, what the hell? That's so weird. Did he use both hands? Or did he... <laughs> Excuse me, is everything okay? Stay back, man. I got this. Mmm, juicy. He's enjoying that back meat man jerky. Don't come any closer. Excuse me, sir. I'm gonna have to uh, shoot you in the head a couple of times. There we go. Thank you. If you can stay down for me, I would appreciate that. Oh my god, these pictures. <laughs> what are you trying to do to me, game? Stay down, please. Oh, he's getting up. It makes me think I need to start getting some posters for my room. <laughs> I'm so bad at decorations. Like, my room looks extremely plain. Leon to the rescue! Let's go! We gotta get out of here. You alright? Yeah, I think so. Thanks. You can thank me later when we're safe. Holy shit. They just came out of nowhere. If they're that close to this gas station. I don't think blowing up Raccoon City really solved anything. Hold on. Like, look how far he's driving to the city. If they're out of the city. What's going on? I don't know. Hopefully, they'll have some answers at the police station. Wait, you're a cop? Yeah. Leon Kennedy. And you are? Claire. Claire Redfield. Oh, yeah. He's, well, he stole yeah. the cop car. Looking for my brother. He's a cop, too. Well, it's a good thing we found each other. I don't know what to expect anymore. Leon looked tired. Like, he's been through a lot. Let the intro throw. Sound like I was about to spit, but nah, I ain't got no bars. <laughs> Yusuke. Yoshiki Adachi. Arihiro Goda. Toshio Isoko. I don't know if I'm saying these names right. I'm sorry. <laughs> Jun Takeichi? Takuichi? Resident Evil 2. Attention all citizens. Due to the citywide outbreak, it feels like this game just came out like very very recently yeah but I think game is like no, two years old now it's a big city there has to be Why does it look like my graphics is off a little bit? Like, I think I modded the game a little bit when I first played it. 
you know, costumes and whatnot. It's like we're walking from here. Surprise attack! How did the zombies get so close to the car? There's like no spatial awareness. Now that's a man that's dedicated to his job. <laughs> he kept driving. <laughs> He drove for a long time too. He's probably getting some medical help. That poor man with that zombie looking wife of his. Oh! Broken back. I'm good, bro. I can't stay here. It's not safe. Oh shit. Yep. Ahead. It's time to get out of here. I'll meet you at the station. Deuces. Excuse me. I can't stop. Gotta keep moving. So when I played this game originally, I did a speed run. I don't think I'm good at this game <laughs> just because I said that <laughs> but I did do a speed run of this game I was following a walkthrough on the best routes to take and the easiest way you can like save bullets and not have to fight beat the game in like two hours or something like that to get the best weapons and the infinite weapons you have to do it on hardcore too oh. Hold on. There we go. All right. The RPD Raccoon City Police Station. That's what I'm talking about. Was there anything out here? I don't think there were. Everybody's favorite location. Beautiful. Anybody here? Oh, bullets. Let's go. No need to save it yet. Oh, I don't have anything. I thought I had like special weapons and stuff. I don't need this anymore. Just shoot him in the head. You there? I found a way out. It's in here. I wonder where was Marvin at? Send reinforcements. East hallway. He can't handle one zombie. I should help this guy. I think. Hmm, I'm going to pick it up. I'm just going to put it in my chest for now because I, I know there's like a lot of stuff I need to carry. And this is going to be in the way. Keep out. So, of course, I'm going to go. Nah, I would, I would turn around. <laughs> I would not crawl in all that blood and whatever the shit that is. No, thank you. 
I swear, if I was in a horror movie, the movie would end quickly. Like, really quickly. Either I would die really early, <laughs> then I guess the movie will continue. <laughs> or I would just nope the hell out of Focus. the house or wherever it is I'm in. Like, if I walk into a room and the lights turn off by itself, I'm walking out of the room. <laughs> That's it. Thank you. I'm gonna need those. I think that's all that's in here. I'm not trying to speed run this, so we all good. I just had the urge to play something a little scary again. Like, no one's done the creep factor better than um, Mr. X. They tried in uh, Resident Evil Village, and it was good, but it still it was, it wasn't as good as Mr. X. Oh, you're the one that gets up, aren't you? I'm coming. I'm here. Open the door. Huh. Hurry up. Hurry up. Open it. Uh, Larry, give me your hand. Help me. Just crawl, man. Crawl. Hold on. Give me your, give me your other hand. Why would you turn around? <laughs> that zombie was hungry. Like, really hungry. That's half a man. That was like a redhead zombie or something. Notebook. All right. He dies and we immediately steal his things. If I remember right. Nope. <laughs> Speed run. Oh, he's out. Probably not a good thing. Nope. Yeah. I... <laughs> you just have to fight smart, is all. Let's, let's turn on the lights. Why is it dark in here? Oh, first miss. Headshot. Another miss. <laughs> Reload, come on! How many? Oh, okay. He's down. All right, he's down for good. Okay. Wait, how many shots does it take in the head? Oh, nice. Before a zombie stops being a zombie and starts petering on the like teetering on the road of a a demigod. Are you are you down? Is is that it? I feel like that's not all of them. Okay. Oh, what? I heard him. Oh! <laughs> that's scary. He's right here. Wow. It'd be so close, too. I probably shouldn't waste the bullets. But I know... I'm going to be back in this hallway again, right? I don't want you to get up. Nice, a board. I want all of those. You're not gonna get up, are you? All right, he's staying down. Let's get out of here. I don't think I've ever gotten that board before. That's a lie, I killed you all. I don't know why the zombies didn't just bite my legs. Safe. But now, 
He was going for the neck. Marvin Brenner. Thanks. Obviously, someone taught you well. Yeah, I know how to take care of myself. That's right. Come on. Yeah, don't touch that gross hand. Get that away from me. <laughs> Nobody knows what caused this. You know, it's a good thing. There's a lot of theories. You can't get infected with Robert zombie blood that this place is through contact on the skin. Yeah, you're telling me. Hey, hey, keep that on, just in case. I'm not gonna be around long. Once I find Chris, we're out of here. You really Chris's sister? Yeah. Yeah. Why? Do I, why would I lie? Mark, did you find something? He's on vacation. Europe, I think, left weeks ago. Oh, wow. Vacation? That sounds like a story. That's, that's great news. Well, I've got more for you. Looks like there might be a way out through this secret passageway. Good. <gasps> hey. Uh, hey, we should probably get you to a hospital. Uh, Rhoda, forget about me. The secret passageway in the museum. No. Don't be ridiculous. You're going to need some help. Listen, Claire. Save yourself. So you can see your brother again. Aw. Everyone loves Marvin. You probably need this. No, I'm not taking that. You're going to... And be careful. If you see one of those things. No matter who they were, you can't hesitate. Take them out if you can. Or you run. Oh, the acting is so good. It's like he's a real person. I swear. I can't even draw a stick figure. And these guys are like making realistic people in video games. I can copy a stick figure though. <laughs> All right, so where am I going? Let's go to the uh, let's go to the chest to put some stuff up. I'm keeping this. I'm putting this up. I don't need it right now. I'm definitely keeping the weapon. I feel like I need more space already. Nah, I don't need to save yet. I forgot, how do you use the knife? Okay, got it. Like riding a bike. Let's go. Alright, this is the worst part of the game. I hate this area. So I will be trying to board up everything in here. Ugh. Just looks like like the inside of a sausage. What? Who's there? Jesus. Let me knock him down. Ooh. Jesus, his head's just <laughs> split in two. The reason why I wanted to knock him down is because if I get chased, that's not going to get in the way, you know? I'm going to use a board right here. Stop anything from getting in. I'm going to try to board up this entire area. Oh, I shouldn't have used a board right here. God dang it. <laughs> I really shouldn't have used the board right there. It's all good. September 25th, we're turning the station into a temporary shelter due to the massive sudden outbreak. All police personnel have been instructed to make the safety of the citizens their top priority as we try to accommodate as many of them as possible. September 25th, 
One of the refugees attacked us in the middle of the night, resulting in the death of one officer and injuring three others. The person in question was quickly restrained. We believe that this was simply a case of someone snapping under intense stress. September 26. A mob attacked the station today, resulting in a number of casualties. A few survivors were able to make it safely behind the emergency shelters, but suddenly, as we were, it would be hard for any of us to escape this place. We're not sure we can fix any of our comm equipment, so we remain cut off from the outside world. September 27. There was another clash on the west side of the station around 1 p.m. Twelve people died, and there is only a handful of survivors left. Everything's fallen into disarray. In here. I don't know why I said in here, like, so separately. <laughs> David Ford. I don't know if I should read all of them. I just wanted to read that one. Map. Nice. Oh, I'm just gonna kill them. Kill them now. Yep, bet you feel stupid now, don't you? Yep, she's still coming. Ooh, nice headshot. <laughs> Love it. <laughs> That's another thing that they missed in Resident Evil uh, 3. There was like no headshot gore. It's like they downgrade it. Hey, dude. Jesus. He still wanted the snack. <laughs> Guy just wanted the snacky snack. I don't think you're dead, dude. I knew it. Oh, you're dead now. Are you dead? Oh, you're not. You're faking. You're phony! Alright, he reached out. I think he's dead. Oh yeah, the knife breaks, doesn't it? You gotta be careful. Oh, I don't have anything for that yet. It appears that the keypad to the locker's terminal is missing a few keys. I suggest that the person responsible for the mess find some spare keys and fix it right now. You know who you are, bastard. <laughs> who else fuck it up this badly? Jesus. Oh, there's my weapon right there. Yeah, I don't have anything yet. Let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. Oh, yeah, you're another faker, aren't you? Nice. Are you dead? You're dead. Oh, this knife is so much stronger. You take that. Use a gunpowder, acid rounds, handgun ammo, okay, submachine gun. There's a lot of ammo left in the station, so make good use of the gunpowder you find. Different guns require different ammo, so pay attention when you're combining things or you won't get what you need. Okay. Nice. I'm just keep topping myself off with the handgun bullets. I know you're not that dude. Oh my god, that's like five shots to the head. You don't even have a face no more. Jeez, what is that? Seven? Oh, that's a miss. Eight? Nine? Did you really just take nine shots to the face? Okay, he's dead. Had to make sure. I don't remember the code, but that would be nice if I did. You know what? I may read all of it. September 28th, 2.30 a.m. It's down to just me and three others. No weapons, no ammo, and too many skirmishes have drained us mentally and physically. We're not going to make it. Officer Phillips once suggested we escape through the sewers. Apparently there's a secret tunnel under the place left over from its museum days. I brushed our idea off before, but now it's not sounding all that bad. Yeah, there's no proof that there's even a tunnel or the sewers aren't infested with zombies. But I don't want to sit here and wait to die either. It's a long shot, but I'm going to try to find out what I can about the tunnel. Elliot Edward. I think that's the guy that got torn in half. Rookie's first assignment. 
Leon S. Kennedy, we're putting you in a very special case for your first assignment. Your mission is to unlock your desk. The key to your success is in the initials of your our first names and put the letters in order of our desk. There are two locks, one on each side of your desk. Make sure you get them both. Basically, your first task is to remember your fellow officers' names, but you figured that out that much out, right? Good luck, Leon. By the way, it might take a little work to get Scott to give you a straight answer. Oh, scribbled in the corner between the drop of blood. Be glad you're not here, rookie. Oh, man. Welcome, Leon. Okay, so what is it? I think from this side on. So, N, E, D. N, E, D. Ned. These are going to be longer episodes, by the way. It's like, I don't do 30-minute episodes. Um, oh, here we go. Uh, G. R. M. Or M. R. G. Nice. All right, what do I get? Oh, nice. What does that mean, though? I guess I can reload faster. Do I, do I unlock it from this side? Okay. I don't have the key. I thought I unlock it from this side. Or is it locked on both sides? That's weird. All right. I can't block. Oh, yes, I can. We'll block that. You ain't getting in here. No way. I'm going to put these up. Don't need them right now. What's in here? Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Give me all the handgun bullets, please. You know what? Maybe some handgun bullets. The more handgun bullets, the better. Uh, medicinal benefits of herbs. Humans have used herbs to treat sickness and disease since the dawn of time. In this book, we would explore three such herbs native to the Akle Mountains. Green herbs have the ability to heal basic injuries, while blue herbs have long been used to treat poisoning. You don't get poison in this game, I don't think. As for red herbs... Well, they are visually appealing, they offer no medicinal benefits, or so it was taught until recently. It's well known that combining herbs together produces blends and heightens the herbs' effects, but it has been discovered that red herbs can play a big role when mixed properly. According to one doctor of Asian medicine, mixing blue and red herbs together produces a blend that will strengthen one's constitution. Truly, we have only just begun to realize the full potential of these herbs and their ability to heal the human body. Further research is sure to yield even more fascinating results. Okay, oh, okay, so I can take more damage. It's like I'm learning all this for the first time. Okay, you need rails for that. Film contains evidence. Do not leave out. Save point. All right, let's put this up. And we're good to go. Let's continue. Hey, what's up, man? You are not dead. Take these shots to the face. Are they stronger when they're getting up? Hey, whoa. <laughs> You, you kind of slipped there, buddy. Hope you don't mind getting shot in the face. Because, uh, I'm going to shoot you in the face. Thank you. Are you dead? You are not dead. You're such good actors. How's my knife? Whoa. I thought he was going to grab me. You're dead, right? Yeah, you're dead. Thanks for the bullets. 
See you later, idiot. Uh, I'll take it. I might have to just run and um I forgot about you. <laughs> Better out than in, I always say. Wait, do I remember this? Do I remember this? DCM? Uh no. Uh cap maybe? Nice. Big brain, I remember that. I'm gonna put all this stuff up, by the way. I'm gonna be running back and forth. Portable safe instructions. Press a button to light up the corresponding light uh, lamp. Light them all to open the safe. The buttons must be pressed in a certain order. Pressing a single button out of order will cause all the lights to go out and you will need to start the sequence over. What fun. And it's never the same. So let's do it. Uh, first one? Nope. Nope. Okay. Oh, wait, wait. Oh, come on. So one, two, three, four. Okay. All right. So one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. No. One, two, oops. One, two, three, four. Uh, okay. you, you just don't know. Oh, wait, that one's first now? Uh, this one? I'm, uh, right there. And then... This one? <laughs> Alright! It worked! The one I pressed first always changed. <laughs> Alright, let's go. I'm going to throw that stuff inside, and I also just got the button, so I'm going to use that as well. It's a lot of management. Um, inventory management. I can't imagine going through the game without ever using the chest. But I think that's another achievement you can do for those hardcore gamers. Let's put the button in there. Oh, what's the best button to put? Two? It's, I think it's two. Mm -hmm. I think it's two. Yeah, cause three, wait. I mean, yeah, you need two and three on that one. Yeah, you need two for that, okay. The best button to put is two for now. Okay. So uh, 102. Uh, 106, 109. 102, enter. Okay. Uh, 106. And 109. And just from the top of my head, I think it was 206 on the other one. No, it wasn't. Which one was it? It was 203 and 208. Okay. 208. Alright. I don't need that one. Well, yes, I do, actually. I thought that was film. No, this is film. This is the film I don't need. So I'm gonna just put that up. And nice. Alright, we're good to go. You're free to like just run around the place until Mr. X shows up. He's like the boss. Oh wait, wait. <laughs> He's just gonna be banging on that window. Let's put this stuff up. Alright, we're good to go. Let's go. Inventory management. Done. That's how you successfully get through these games. The guy that used to be up here, he already fell. Let's go. 39 bullets. I'm doing good. 
I do not remember the code to this. DCM? That's like my go-to or something. Oh, it was DCM! I don't need it right now, but I'm gonna take it. Nice. Posing for the camera, looking stylish as ever. Got a key. Okay, where am I? Oh, first liquor sighting. That was called a liquor. 20 survivors. Consider this a gift to anyone still unfortunate enough to be alive. Keep your eyes peeled for those creepy fucks that look like they were skinned alive. Lickers, we call them. They're blind as bats, but those hearing, but they're hearing more than makes up for that. So long as you don't run around like a total idiot, guns are blazing, you should be able to slip right past them. Probably. Either way, make like a grandma and creep around as slow as possible around them, yeah? Anyway, not that I want to go. But duty calls. That, and I got a friend to avenge. David. But well, thanks for the info, man. I'll take it. And I'll take it. You just, I'm just a oh, pack rack. <laughs> just collect everything. Oh! That actually scared me. Can I shoot him down? Yes, I can. All right. <laughs> I was starting to think I was wasting my ammo. Nice. Some guy scribbling. Damn those corporate assholes. They cut me off. I thought all I'd done for them. But if that's how it's going to be, so be it. I'm going to have a little fun of my own as the world goes to shit. I bought all those filthy pigs up in steel pens and set some C4. All I gotta do is detonate it in sayonara, suckers. But it's no fun if it's over too soon. So maybe I'll give that one raven loon something to really squeal about. Yeah. Maybe I'll give him a little toy and tell him, kill the guy next to you and I'll spare the others. I wonder if what he'll do. You yell about justice and pride, but how many times did you go against me? Your own superior. Yeah, you're such a good cop. So good you had to die. Man, this is fun. I need some music for this. <laughs> what an asshole. Grade A asshole. Let's see. Oh, it says, yes! So many bullets. I'm, I'm doing so well. I'm just like patting myself on the back. <laughs> Hey, Marvin. How fast can you get back here? Why was that? I've got something to show you. It's important. All right, I'm on my way. Roger that, homie. Oh, they are so loud. Come on, headshots. Are you dead? I knew he wasn't. I feel, I feel the same way. Same way, Claire. I, I dropped you twice. You should be gone. And I know you're not dead. Get up, dude. Wait, hold up. Stay there. Let me reload. What is up with you? <laughs> what is up with you? There you go. How's my knife doing? It's almost it's almost gone. I'm going to pick up the new knife. Oh yeah, the unicorn. Another map, nice. Um, I can actually make something else with that. Or do I need more? Hmm. I'm going to I'm gonna keep it for now. I don't. I'm not. I don't need the bullets right now. So, this was the very top one. This is a unicorn. So it's fish, scorpion, and 
uh, like win, I guess. A pot. Fish. Scorpion. And win in a pot. Nice. All right, we're good to go. Let's go meet Marvin and see what he wanted. After I kill this guy that's munching on this dude over here. Stop! You asshole. <laughs> you asshole. Can't you see he's not trying to fight back? Are you gone? Wait, wait nope, he's still alive. You dead now? Nope. You stay dead, dude. Oh man, you look messed up. <laughs> Let's pre-stage that. Nice. Let's pre-stage this one as well. I still remember. Don't you remember? Oh, this book as well. Oh, okay. Inventory management. Let's just make this. Alright, open up. Was there anything over here? There is. So far, so good. 54 ammo. We are doing fantastic. And there's the, um, the lion statue. I don't know why I want to say tiger so bad. So let's check this out. Is a lion head, uh, a leaf, and a bird. Lion head, a leaf, and a bird. Nice. Marvin, my guy. Still working, Come even here. with that gut shot. What is it? Take a look. Oh my god, he made it! He's just standing there. You know him? Yeah, it's Leon. Uh, Kennedy, I think. Oh, uh, the rookie. She's good with names. Familiar. You can make it to that courtyard. The second floor, east side. Okay. Thanks, Marvin. I'm on it. <laughs> that smile she gave him was so creepy. Oh, let's let's put these up. Let's put these inside. So Elliot was right. Yeah, we're not out of here yet. I got one more of these and two knives. Let's put some stuff up. Um. I can use this book now, I think. Let's put this up. Equip that one. Put this up. I think I can use that book like pretty much now. If I go upstairs. But I know I need more room. For stuff I'm gonna pick up downstairs. So I'll probably run back to the chest. I know there's a lot of running back and forth. There truly is. Um, did you know? Well, I don't think I'm going to read this pamphlet. <laughs> Raccoon City Police Pamphlet, The Orphanage. Nah. Who turns a museum into a police station? Who turns a museum into a police station? It's a good question. Hmm. Magazine. Hmm. Nice. Now I can get the um the grenade launcher already. I give him this book. I didn't give it to this man. This wizard. 
Gives me a Sailor Moon Scepter. Sailor Moon! <laughs> Alright, and I take the jewel out and I guess I throw away the scepter. Red jewel. I forgot what you need the red jewel for, but I have it. That's it. And I think that's it for now. But again, I like to collect stuff and just store it away for later. I don't know if I'm just going to skip out all the, um, like edit all the running back and forth to the chest. Or I might just leave it as is. Let's put... Let's put this up. Put this up. Let's put the, the jewel up. And everything else I pretty much need, I think, so... Let's just go. I haven't got hit yet, so that's something. But these are the, the slow-moving zombies. You know? They brought them back. Those running zombies and shooting zombies and swimming zombies is crazy. Just a random helicopter. Like, did he run out of fuel or was he bitten too? It's crazy. Do I need that? I'll take it. I wonder what was that guy's story. Leon! I'll be right there. He's just standing there in the rain like a weirdo. <laughs> Leon, we really gotta stop meeting like this. Oh, she's in on right. Police chopper just came out of nowhere. Yeah, I'm fine. I take it you don't have the key. She's smiling hard, too. No, <laughs> Leon got that game without even having to say anything. Though. Oh, How look at that. Up? I am hanging in there. Hell of a night, huh? Yeah. Did you find your brother? I did, actually. He's... <laughs> Just me think he can't get any worse. Leon, you should get going. Oh, he's getting up like the Undertaker. Don't worry about me. Just get yourself to see. They're so strong. They're getting to the fence. Please just go. We're gonna make it. Both of us. Of course. Your life is in my hands. Oh, nice. I got so many bullets. Marvin? Marvin, are you there? I'm starving like Marvin, man. God, you gotta be kidding me. <laughs> Bye, guys. Let's go. Yeah, I knew you wasn't dead. Oh, he is dead. <laughs> oh, what a waste of bullets. Oops. Did somebody just walk in? Oh, I, I thought somebody just walked in. Okay, somebody did walk in. And I needed to reload. You're dead, right? Oh, they are coming for me. Just die, dude. Thank you. There's somebody else in here, isn't it? This guy. Hell is up with you. Oh, he's getting up. Oh, five bullets in the chamber sucks. 
Are you dead? Alright, I dropped you twice. Are you dead? Okay. You guys like to play dead. Like possums. You are not dead. Okay, now you're dead. Oh, you got something on you. Nice. I didn't get hit. Why is it telling me how to how to heal? I need this. And I need this. Okay, so now I have white and, and this one. Let's combine them. Acid rounds. Acid rounds, if I remember right, are really good. And I need this. I can combine the green with the green. I kind of feel like it's a waste, but I don't think I'm coming back into this office. Oh, never mind. Oh, wait, I know what I'm going to do. Combine the green with the green. Oh, wait. But that's not gonna that's not going to clear up the space for me, is it? You know what? I got an idea. Oh, what? Wait. Oh, you! I think he's dead now. Are you? Yes, he is. If I remember right, there's somebody behind that door. Is there? I do not like how the music's kicking up. Okay. Oh, there is somebody there. What the hell? He was just standing there. Are you dead, dude? He's dead. That was creepy. And then I'm going to go back and get it. Nice. Um, LB and whatever. Okay, cool. I'll keep the knife on me. How much stuff do I have? I got a decent amount of stuff. You know, I'm going to go into this hallway. Just to, um... How much stuff do I have? Just to close everything. Oh, dang it! Shit. Came in too fast. Let's close that. That's closed off. But I have these two guys. Seriously? Man, what a tough guy. Are you dead? You're not dead. You're dead now. <laughs> it's funny how they just... Ooh, I shot her jaw off. That's crazy. Mm -hmm. Let's close this. No more of those. You're dead, right? You're not dead. Damn it. All right, I think she's dead now. You're right. All right, got to make sure. <laughs> Whoa! Oh, I missed some bullets right here. Oh, I'm so glad I can throw this away. I got too much stuff. 
cap. I did that one already. Another board. Get so many boards now. Oh, another one of these. I'm so glad you can combine them, you know? Speaking of combining, should I? <laughs> I guess so. It's probably a waste. Because one red and one green would make it perfect. Okay. So if I remember this, let's use the key on this. So then we just have a way out when we get chased. And the key's gone. All right, don't have to worry about that, that anymore. A little shortcut. Oh, wait. I have the, um, I got the weapon key card thing. So you know what? I'm gonna go over here. I'm gonna use the weapon key card. I'm gonna get the grenade launcher. Come on, come on. Let's see here. When do I, oh, I know when I need this. I know exactly when I need this. Uh, let's put this up. Let's keep that. And let's get the key card. And let's put the, the health up. I don't see myself getting hit yet. Um, I think everything else is good. Because I'm going to use this. I'm going to use this. I'm going to get the batteries for this. I don't think I need that right now. But I might come across some uh, windows I want to board up. But not yet. I don't, I don't think I'm going to come across any windows I'm going to board up yet. Let's get that grenade launcher. I still don't know the, uh, the codes uh, for that. I think I get that inside the star's office. Nice. Give me that grenade launcher. We are good to go. Let's load that up. As a just in case. All right. I think we're going to end the video right here. <laughs> I'd like to thank you for watching, if you're watching this. <laughs> and we are going to continue all the way through the end of this game. It's going to be like hour-long videos. And hopefully I won't, I won't die a lot to get lost. <laughs> because I really don't remember a lot of this. Wait, do I still have to film? Anyway, guys. I'll see you guys in the next one. And thanks for watching. Goodbye.